Hello everyone, Code Dude right here. And as you might have known from the title of this video, that I'm programming at the balcony of my house. Uh, and the thing that we are going to do today is that we are going to modify the basic menu app that we created for Gordon Ramsay because he personally requested me to make a program for for him and that's basically fine by me uh, so previously I sent a very basic program to him basic menu but today we'll make a little bit advanced menu for my man um, so basically what we will do is that we will uh, mm, so them so the customers the final price of the food the total price of the food in a pop-up like I think that's called a pop-up and also we will um, uh, so the description of the foods that we have on the menu right because those foods are you know pretty pretty unique foods maybe no one have tasted them yet so without starting let's start and I like to fully provide you the disclaimer that I'm you might be hearing lots of background noises maybe of cars or motorcycles or anything maybe people speaking because I'm at the balcony you know let's copy that let's copy the basic program that we made uh, and so the first thing we'll do is we'll import masses box masses box and so basically we'll be modifying from here modifying this thing right here we'll we do not need that uh, so we'll go for let's go for Mm. Answer A N S W A answer equals to message box the ask question. Yeah, that's what we need. I think we need to add the title uh, order confirmation. Uh, and we'll add the final products right uh, I think so yeah we'll add the final product yeah so let's go for what I don't know what that is you will be I, I think this might be rude but anyway I am rude. You will pay uh, plus str. That is final. Yeah, str f i n a l final dot dot p a c k pack. So let us see if this works or not. Uh, let's go for motorcycle kick and let's order yeah that works so maybe to make it a bit more formal or basically the business type let's add uh, this and uh, would you like to confirm your order please <laughs> order please no businessman really wants to say please to the customers because they are looting the customers anyway just to be formal uh, let's go for please uh, yeah let's don't let's not write please yeah uh, so if the user says if answer equals to yes uh, then we'll um, 
display masses box I think so info yeah uh, thanks for confirmation confirmed yeah let's go for order confirmed uh, and after that order confirmed and for the contents we'll write thank you for ordering from the most polite chef <laughs> you will get your order in Gordon Ramsay wants the food fresh so he'll have to deliver the food in 8 minutes right uh, but L is N yeah and we need to pack uh, this as well so I don't know if you guys can actually see this long text so what I can do is uh, so I'll try I hope that you guys can see this text uh, dot p p a c k back right uh, for you guys to see Allah so this is what I'm done back uh, I've just back that else if else if answer equals to is fine though no then we'll display so info uh, and order this will be the title order C A N C E L cancelled and we'll give the point we'll give this message in the pop-up message I hope my accent or my way of telling you guys message is correct uh, the order is can solve thank you for your time Yeah, I think this is basically it for ordering it. I hope you guys can see this. Let's go for Ebola free mangoes and Corona free bats and dengue free mosquitoes and pizza, chicken pizza and motorcycle cake. Is that 2000? Yes, it is. I hope that is. If you guys really want to check, pause this video, add all this amount. Anyway. You'll pay at the uh, you'll pay so I'm basically using Nepali slang in the middle. I'll try not to use them because I have got international audience. I hope so. You will pay two thousand. Would you like to confirm your order? Let's go for yes. Huh. So that's an error. And the error says uh has no attribute. Okay, so what did I do wrong? But that showed me, right? Hmm. I don't know what exactly this error means though. STR object has no attribute back. Puh. So can we do without adding STR as our function? Uh, so basically I will research about it. You guys can research as well. 
I hope this runs good. Let's go with chicken pizza order. Yeah, it says so. The error that we got was we need to only concatenate str. Uh huh. So we will do str and hope it does not show us that same error. Motorcycle cake order. Yes, but it still showed me the error. Hmm. So I'll search to the internet about this error and come to you guys very soon. Two moments later. I found what exactly the problem is. Uh, so I thought that I'm basically just adding this in a window created by Kinter, but in reality that's not. We are using masses box at the moment. So this pack is not <coughs> what I need. I, I need to, yeah, that's what it meant that SCR object has no attribute pack. So this right here is a string function and there's no such thing as packing this function in a masses box. We only do that in Kinter. So hopefully it runs now. Let's go for chicken pizza order. Yes. Thank you for ordering from the most polite chef. You will get your order in eight minutes. Just the thing I needed. Let's go for, uh, yeah. So, same thing right here. And again, let's go for Corona free bats. Let's order, but who wants to eat Corona free bats, right? Bats are the filthiest thing ever, except Batman. He's very rich. Let's go for no. Yep. I did it. So, next thing we'll do is that we will create a new window. And in the new window, uh, it will show the information of the foods that we have. Because see, we have very unique foods, Ebola free mangoes, and what really does motorcycle cakes mean? We need to show to the cost consumers what exactly those things mean, right? For that, uh, let's create a new button. Uh, no food equals to button root text text equals to know your know the foods you gotta know the foods once you are going to marry to them right once you're going to have once you're going to make love to the food you gotta know your food man uh, text equals to this and command equals to uh, mm, let's go for no your so if this was variable that we would have to that I think my grammar was a mistake there I did a grammatical mistake if this if that was a variable which we had to use for a couple of times I wouldn't have used a long name for the variable but basically this is a function that we'll be using for only a single time uh, so let's write long name no your I think no the food or no your food no your food okay you gotta know your food before you make love know your food and I think we'll go for a new file right yeah let's go for new equals to top top label uh, and 
I think we need to add the title as well title uh, know the food and after that let's do uh, let's start writing maybe we'll write in a string function uh, so I think the first one is free mangoes right Ebola free mangoes e uh, mangoes equals to this delicious mangoes are from the stomach of bats in the form of Poop in the form of poop. Poop. But they are tasty none the less. Why? Because ah, uh, so why? Let's change the what do you call it the lines why huh so so I, I have a doubt whether you guys can actually see after that certain greed or not um, I do not exactly no so huh so guys I'll check this out and you guys can confirm that so well, basically I'll confirm that so anyway uh, I think I don't want to show you guys my browser yep uh, so this works uh, this works we can do like this inside this it's to enter and why because it is prepared by the most humble chef ever who never sees the word like toot like toot you know what I mean and he uh, was a football player uh, I know you guys can see that so football player he was a football player uh, football player so he uses his ball power ball power in his foods come taste uh, eat this eat this if you want to taste his balls power hey guys do not take this joke as an adult joke 
but in reality this is just i'm just talking about footballs right because he has an ability to use his balls or to skill to manipulate the balls you know what i mean and after mangoes uh so i think this is good for mangoes uh after mangoes we'll write something for corona 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 equals i think you guys basically know what i'm doing so let me just go for corona bats right corona bats i'm now becoming lazy let's copy this control c i don't need to read what exactly that means huh let's copy this and don't you guys worry uh these things make quite a lots of problem let's control z that this is not the text that i want i want very simple text and i think i've done that we yeah, have done that quotation mark very control c i hope this will not create any problems for me yep no problems at the moment uh and the thing we'll do is we'll just enter that enter and enter and and enter so that you guys can see there's no problem for me to see but it's you guys because i'll have to you know magnify or so this in pretty zoom form so there's a reason why i'm cropping the window size while recording so that you guys can see it uh so these are the only things that we are going to print at the moment in a new window uh um, and so now let's start writing them yeah so the first thing we'll do is we'll label where the question is where the answer is new and text will be uh ebola free mangoes ebola free mangoes uh and we'll pack that let's pack that and again we will uh label this or use this for a couple of times i think my battery is about to go down so it would be very necessary to solve these things as fast as possible uh ebola free mangoes and when we do that will mangoes print mangoes and after that for enough free bats for corona free bats and it will be corona <sighs> i hope this is good okay that's very simple mistake i don't know if my neighbor is listening to me and they are being like why the hell that man is speaking to his laptop yeah let's go for chicken okay so we didn't pack that button did we no we didn't so we'll do that 
so I think we need to do this before that ordering button order button because like people may want to know the food that they are or what control V control Z what the hell man control Z control Z control Z control Z control Z control yeah we'll just control X this right and we'll control V this uh, let's see yeah so this came know your food and so this came as well but I exactly do not know oh okay so maybe we need to control and some of the things hmm uh, why let's do n let's do n and let's do n let's do n and let's do n uh, I hope this is good for now move the food yes it is it will have free mangoes this delicious mangoes are from the stomach of bats in the form of poop but that takes lead nonetheless why because it is prepared from the most humble chef ever who says that the world like toot but and he was a football player football player that's a mistake you guys can edit that so he uses his ball power in his foods he uses his ball power if you want to taste his ball power and you can write anything be creative and write anything in the place of corona free bats so i think let's do taste that again yeah no let's do that let's go for ebola free mangoes and corona free let's order them no yeah guys see you you guys can see me now at the next video which will be uploaded pretty soon and that depends upon the internet speed See you guys soon. Bye.